Now today I want to pray for uh, you, perhaps, uh, or you've got a loved one or a friend that's admitted uh, at the hospital or right now they're in the world, whatever department there is and whatever sickness it is, I pray today is for all anybody and all those that have been admitted right now at the hospital. And so I want to ask you if you uh, don't mind, don't hesitate to hit the subscribe button and also hit that uh, uh, bell notification so that next time we get to upload another prayer, you'll be notified and you'll be among the first people to get away. And we trust that the Lord God is faithful and will do a miracle to you. Amen. I shall stretch my hand right now to you on that hospital bed. Now, I don't care how long you've been admitted. I don't care how long you've been there. But what I care and what I know deep down in my heart is that there's a God that is able to get you out of that hospital bed, back to your house, back to your place of work, back to your family, and whatever place that you need to be right now. And so I, res- I speak to the spirit right now of sickness, of diseases, of infirmity. I rebuke it right now in the name of Jesus. Hmm. The young David said, as a young boy, when he was confronting Goliath, he said that you come to me with a shield, with a sword, and we javelin. them. But I come to you. And my answer, Father, is the name of the Lord God. Of host and David was able to, 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 to get victory that day in front of the entire army of Israel and the Palestinian army. Philistine army. And so, Father, today the sicknesses might have uh, overwhelmed us, diseases might have overwhelmed us, the family might have overwhelmed our bodies. But Lord, that's okay because our answer is no fear, is no worry. But Lord, we will try and we, by the help of the Spirit of God, will remain steadfast and strong. And we will not waver to our right to our left, but we will remain steadfast upon the promises of God. And your word is very simple, that by the stripes we are healed. And so I decree right now, the ye are healed part right now in the name of Jesus. So I decree healing upon my brother and my sister that's been admitted at the hospital in the mighty name of Jesus. And I pray that thy healing power begins to flow right now into your body, to flow right now to every part of your body. If you can't just place your hand to any part of your body that is ailing right now, and we believe the Lord for a miracle right now. I'm so excited in my spirit because I know when the spirit of God is at work, I know when the spirit of God has taken over. And that's why I decree healing over your body right now. In the name of Jesus, healing over your head, healing over your stomach, healing over your bones. In the name of Jesus, healing over your eyes and your ears. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, be it a sickness or be it a chronic disease. Right now, it doesn't matter. I decree that the power of the Spirit of God is coming upon you right now. In the name of Jesus, so I send the word of God. I send the word of healing right now. Let it find you wherever you are, because there is no limit to time or space. In the name of Jesus, in whatever country that you are, as you listening to this prayer right now, I ask right now, in the name of Jesus, one more time, begin to do those things that you are not able to do. Uh, in faith, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I decree total healing right now, in the name of Jesus, and I set you free, I come against every infirmity, every sickness, every disease now, in the name of Jesus, I lose you now from every chains, I set you free from every chains, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, I decree that it is well with you, in the name of Jesus, I decree that you're receiving a good report now from your doctors, in the name of Jesus and even your caregivers because we believe not in the report of man but we choose today to stand and believe in the report of Jesus Christ the report that says that it is well with us the report that says that we are healed the report that says hallelujah that we are more than victors and we are more than conquerors and so I speak healing over you my sister I speak healing over you my brother if you join your faith together with mine it is time to rise up right now. It is time to receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Come on, just open up your mouth if you can. I begin to bless the name of the Lord. Thank him for the healing that he has already begun to procure on your behalf. Thank him for the victory. Thank him for the healing in advance in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we do this prayer in the name of your son, in Jesus' name.
Amen. Well, I believe that the Lord God has touched you. And if he has, are we waiting to get here testimony? And so, yes, that you take a second, take a minute to uh, just leave us a testimony. We'll have to know what God has been doing in your life and uh, how, how effective and uh, the impact that our prayers are, uh, are making all over the globe. I shall God bless you. I want to remind you just one more time, if you're yet to subscribe to this channel, when you need any kind of prayers, then it's your home. It's the place that you really have to be. And so go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And from now, it's bye-bye for now. God bless you so much. Receive your healing.